Hello, wonderful people of the whole entire universe. Welcome to the first annual 2022 Mother Hungry. Today we are gonna attempt to make chicken pho with ingredients that I didn't really prepare. But I had the inspiration because look, you see that? That's green onion right there. Bang, look at that, look at that, it's massive, man. I got jalapeno, I got rosemary. All of this is like mints left by the previous owner. And shout outs to everyone who told me that's lavender. Oh, also, look at this, look at this, look at this. I got a little melon coming. <laughs> I heard the pandemic made millennials super farmers. Pretty cool, huh? That's interesting. So by no means am I gonna say that this is authentic pho ever because I really don't know what I'm doing, but I'm taking elements from what I've learned in the past about pho and I'm gonna put it together for you guys and hopefully I could go viral because my good buddy, Uncle Roger, could critique and talk shit about my food. If not, I don't care. We have our green onion, we have carrot, ginger, garlic, and onion. Cook! <laughs> okay, okay, okay. Chicken pho is fascinating, okay? I like to use the salt with iodized because I heard it's good for your, your heart or something like that. I might be bullshit. In Asian, Southeast Asian cuisine, I got put onto this. It's one of the most awesome things I've ever had. It's called star anus. Star anus. Eat it. Eat it? Mm -hmm. Oh, you put it it doesn't taste like nothing. Oh, really? No. Suck on it. It doesn't taste like anything. That's right. Star anus, baby. And we're gonna use whole cloves right here. Oh, damn. Did you know that people used to fight wars for herbs? We got bay leaves, cause you my bay. Oh, that's not romantic. Oh, man. <laughs> I have to be fully transparent with you guys because I feel like a foodie fraud if I didn't do this. But this chicken has been boiling since yesterday. So um, I prepped this early. It's got leg quarters. And by the way, I got four of these bad boys for five bucks. So greasy. Now I like my broth dirty, but other people, they're probably gonna wanna skim this to make it look more presentable. But hell no, I'm trying to get all the oils, okay? When it's too hot, uh, maybe put some ice cubes in there, but like, I don't care. And by the way, don't you put grease down the garbage disposal because you know what happened? This thing is stuck, look at this. It's kind of gross. It's all stuck. You know what I like about the, this kitchen though? What? It makes me want to cook and it makes me want to be the mother hungry all the time, you know? Yeah, because it's so big. Chicken looks gross. What am I gonna do? Up the drain. All right, not too much. We're gonna put some of that there like that. Maybe one more, maybe one more. I know someone's at home going, no, that's not enough, Joe. I would say less is more because um, these things are hot. These things are really strong mm. herbs and they'll punch you in the face like spearmint gum. I think salt should go last, but I'm just gonna do it right now because you're here. Maybe this looks like the block drain. I know, huh? But watch, when you drink it, you're gonna start craving the block drain. Maybe I'll shove my head down then. This technique was taught to me by my Vietnamese friend. He said that you're supposed to get all this stuff and you're supposed to roast it, all right? You're supposed to get this and then you're gonna have a roasty roast. But for me, I ain't gonna do that. You know what I'm gonna do? I'm gonna pan fry it and get a sizzle whizzle. Mm. Instead of a roasty roast, I'm gonna get a sizzle whizzle and then we're gonna get that tasty dizzle inside of the soup dizzle. Is that ginger? Yeah. You love ginger? Yep. Is Just, everything better ginger? Yep, like your hair. Would you eat my pussy if it tasted like onion? I love onion, so I don't know, you're asking the wrong person. Notice how I said I love onion, not I love you. I know, he never says I love you. Shut up, I do. <laughs> Yeah, no. Whenever you say I love you, I go, thank you. I know. Yeah. Because that's how you say I love you back. Thank you? Yeah, you say thank you. Arch your back a little bit, baby. Give them what they want. 
Oh yeah. Oh god. Look at the size of these green onions. Here we put the green onions here. Turn up the heat here. Ooh. And then we soak it in here. Watch out. It's gonna bu oh my goodness. I put too much oil. I hope this pho doesn't taste like olive oil soup. Ooh, look at the soup. Look at the beauty. Oh lordy, lordy. Mm, should I do this for like five hours? Yes, come back in five hours. I processed the magnificent chicken here. And we have the wonderful, wonderful boil going on. I like to put the bones back inside so we get the full, full body. It was earlier, it was yellow, it was clear, but now, mmm, and the smell. Oh my goodness, oh, it smells like Christmas. This star anise, they make it smell like a Christmas, baby. Oh, it's hot. Mmm. There's no salt in here. I thought I put in salt, it's, it, it's lacking salt. I think it has to boil just a little bit longer for all of it to get soaked up into the water. You're doing a live in 30 minutes. Oh yeah. Kinda got the mint leaves for something special. Gotta set the timer for eight minutes because we're gonna do some noodles. Oh my goodness, I am a big mess. Let's just put that over there. That'll do. That'll do. That'll do. Oh, I didn't even start it. Start it. Is that eight minutes? Yeah, eight minutes. In the meantime, we had this one. Oh, it's hot. We've been boiling it for a couple hours now. Ooh, look at that. Ooh, let's see what it looks like. Wow, look at that rich, rich soup. Oh, dear Lord. Oh, my goodness. See, this is what happens. This is what hap. Oh, no, goodness. Oh, my goodness. Ha 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 ha. I'm not that professional. <laughs> In the meantime, we're gonna do the meat sauce. Unfortunately, I am missing hoisin sauce. So, I'm not gonna do this right. But let's hope that this still is good. And this is how I get the whole juice out of the limes. This is called a lemonade squeezer. Because sometimes just squeezing the lime is not enough. See that? This right here, spicy. Oh, that's what you make spicy soup with. This is gonna burn your booty hole. Good, so I like it. We get that sauce, we get the sriracha like that, and then we put the lime like that. And we have our very own Southeast Asian Cambodian man over here to give us the seal of approval. Okay, look at the spicy sauce. <coughs> Damn, I need hoisin sauce. <laughs> Five, four, three, two, one. That's, that's it. Now, that means that the noodles are ready. Oh, I almost <laughs> dropped it. Yo, noodle. Why is that one stuck in there like a sugar? I don't know. Oh, shoot, I shouldn't have left it right here. It's gonna drip all over the place now. <laughs> oh, no. Don't worry, it'll warm back up in the water when you put the soup inside. <laughs> <laughs> it's time to blend it. <laughs> Did you know that um, if you see old medieval pictures of how they ate spaghetti in England, mm. they ate it like this with their hands? Did you know that? I think that's bullshit. No, they did. I'll show you. And now for the chicken that I previously cut. There's so much chicken. Oh! Ooh! Fresh garden. And in here. Our fresh garden, like no. this. 
Look at this. Wow, you see that? Look at this. Wow. You see this? Wow. Oh, you know what? Let's go back for seconds. Let's go for fourths. Let's go for more. Pa -pa -ra -ra. Look at this. Look at this. Chicken fa. Chicken fa. Chicken fa. Ah, chicken fa. Chicken fa. This is what we gonna eating today. First off, let's see how you gonna like it. On my fur, I like to try it without any condiment, no sauce. Straight up from the get go. I don't even know what it tastes like yet. I didn't even try it. That's what I'm saying. That's why you, you gotta taste with no sauce first. Man, all right. Not uh -huh. bad, bro. Okay. Sure. Chicken pho. Oh, it's good. You want a reaction? Mm. What do you want from me? I want you to Just eat it. To Just people. eat it. I tell them the truth, girl. Can't lie. I'm very good. Mmm. Can't lie to a man's heart. You like it? You cook the noodles cook the noodles well. Oh I was, yeah. I was skeptical. Mmm. You can't lie to a man's heart when it comes to his food. Not bad, man. Not bad. I give it like a B plus. B plus? That's not bad. Man. Here we go. I actually haven't ate this myself, so I just have to. What is this? Sauce? Huh? Yeah. Oh shit. It's spicy. Like, the fuck, man? <laughs> it's too spicy? What are you trying to do? <laughs> <laughs> Holy shit. You, I dipped the chicken in it. Yeah. Mm, okay. I like All the right. spice. Okay. Let me see here. Shit. God damn. Mmm. Yeah, that's spicy. Okay, okay. Mmm. Mmm. I like it more and more. The noodle. I really like the noodle. The broth, I'm gonna give it a little bit more time. I think it has, it's only been two hours, but the chicken is super soft and just straight up putting it all together. I think this noodle is really, really, really smooth. Are you satisfied with your own work? Yeah, it's okay. Like Darius says, it is a B plus. There's something missing. And Maybe uh, someone can help me. And the other thing is, um, the noodle is good, but to me, it's more on the soft side. Oh, yeah. okay. You like it hard? It's yeah, overcooked a little side. bit. Oh. At first, you were like this spicy, too crazy. And then now you look at that, dude. That shit looks like boom ball way now. Yeah, I like it. It's a cool little kick. Now it's like spicy chicken soup, huh? Mm -hmm. It's very good. We're sure to end. Oh, I good. I'm eating real fast. Top pho in Vegas. Top pho? Mm-hmm. Because like, we've been to a lot. My pho, favorite pho restaurant? Mm -hmm. In Vegas. I don't know. What about the lobster pho? I like pho Kim Long. Oh, District 1? Yeah, that pho, place is pretty good. Pho Kim Long chicken is bomb. Yeah. Anyways, guys, that's been this episode of Mudda Hungry. Leave comments down below how I could improve on my chicken pho. Please, very much. Thank you. If it's good advice. Yeah, it might be. You never know. We'll see. Okay. Please, let me know, Gordon Ramsay. <laughs> Till next time. Peace. Chuck E. Cheese for my birthday. Chuck E. Chuck E. Chuck E. Cheese for my birthday. Chuck E. Chuck E. Chuck E. Cheese for my birthday. Chuck E. Cheese for my birthday. Birthday. Chuck E. Cheese birthday. Chuck E. Chuck E. Chuck E. Cheese for my birthday. Chuck E. Chuck E. Chuck E. Cheese for my birthday. Chuck E. Cheese for my birthday. Birthday. Chuck E. Cheese.